<clears throat> okay, um, today I'm going to talk about bottled water. Um, is it good or not? What makes bottled water better than tap water? Um, basically, from the manufacturers hyping up the sources about where the waters come from is what makes bottled water so popular. The fact that they claim it's from pristine aquifers, crystal mountains, and like Zephyr Hills. Um, they claim that it's the best quality and it's most purified. However, um, after doing some research, I found out some facts about bottled water that just I had no clue. Um, Bottled water isn't federally regulated like municipal water is, so it doesn't have to be as checked as closely. Uh, bottled water is also considered food under the FDA, while the EPA covers tap water. Tap water is also uh, under much stricter standards because it does run to all of our houses. Um, tap water is, also t is tested from harmful bacteria several times a day while compared to bottled water, um, which is tested maybe once a week. Uh, in 1999, a study found that 18 out of 130 bottled waters were tested and contained at least one sample of more bacteria than allowed under purity guidelines. Um, <clears throat> It also points out as much as 40% of all bottled water comes from city water systems just like tap water. So the report also focuses on the fact that that 70% of all bottled water sold in the U.S. is exempt from the FDA's bottled water standards because the federal standards do not apply to water bottled within a same state. So basically, if a bottled water is bottled in one state and moved across state lines, then they have to check it. But if it's bottled in the same state, they don't. Also, uh, carbonated sparkling waters um, are completely exempt from FDA guidelines that spe set specific contamination limits. There's a lot of studies that show that bottled water contains bacteria, more bacteria than tap water. Chemicals from the plastic leaches into the water. Now, here is a bottle of water. Zephyr Hills. Um, it says 100% natural, pure quality Zephyr Hills water. And it claims to be so purified from the natural springs of Lake County, Florida. Well, what is this bottle made out of? That is the question. It's made out of plastic. How can someone think that something that is processed in a plant, put into plastic, and then shipped, be more healthier than something that comes directly from your house that is regulated? It's um been proven that the plastic itself has leaked into the water um chemicals chemicals in the plastic leak into the water and contaminate it which makes sense because plastic has chemicals in it so the fact that you drink something because it's encased in plastic because you think it's better for you is a little ironic um <sighs> As far as the environment goes, um, the Sierra Club says that the Pacific Institute estimates that the production of bottled water for U.S. consumption in 2006 requires 17 million barrels of oil to make the plastic for the water bottle itself. The amount of energy embedded in the use of making the bottled water is about filling one of these with half of oil that's how much energy gets put into making just the bottle in the u.s more than 30 billion water bottles end up as garbage or litter each year 
It takes three liters of water to produce one liter of bottled water. So it takes just, it takes way more water to make something like this than it does just to buy it, just to drink it from your house. Um, by contrast, municipal water only requires a little bit of energy to pump the water pump the water through pipes into our houses. The energy required to manufacture and transport these bottles severely drain limited fossil fuels. Cost. Now, what did this water bottle cost me? I don't know. I got it in a pack. So I can't say that I'm perfect because for I use water bottles for convenience because I'm lazy. But um, it, people pay one one dollar to four dollars a gallon for a completely unknown quality and purity of bottled water, and that quality and purity is left up to the corporate executives who have little or no background in water quality. Americans are willing to pay top dollar for bottled water, which costs up to. 1900 times more than tap water and uses up to 2,000 times more energy to produce and deliver. Some cities, including San Francisco, Albuquerque, Minneapolis, Seattle, have banned purchases of single serving bottled water because of the impact on the environment, which I think is a great idea. Um, would I have my convenient water bottle? No, I wouldn't. I would find another way to have convenient water. Um, Chicago started a five cent tax on plastic bottles, bottles of water, and um, U.S. consumers spent 16.8 billion on bottled water since that time, according to the trade publication Beverage Digest. So, in my opinion. I don't think bottled water is good for anybody, not the environment, not for our wallets, not for the earth, not for oil, not for anything. It's a waste and it's basically like bottling up some air and trying to sell it because these are things that are natural to the earth. So if you really want to go buy some bottled oxygen, Go right on the head, and then while you're at it, get a bottle of water. And I'm sure I will figure out some other way to to um, have convenient water. I'll go buy a reusable, environment-friendly container and refill it with tap water. But there are plenty of ways to not to not use this bottle. It's just not, 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 uh, it's just not smart. It's not economically smart. It's not environmentally smart. Nothing about it is smart. <sighs>